So today's goal, Missouri Mountain. Let's walk back here to the trailhead. So it starts here at the trailhead. Looks like we're gonna be walking across the bridge, Clear Creek. Pretty easy walk in up until we get hammered by these switchbacks about four tenths of a mile in. 2.2 miles up to the split. Moderate elevation gain to this point. And then we're just gonna be following this creek. Uh, the creek does not look to have a name, at least not on this map. 1.6 miles up to these hammering switchbacks as we climb and get all of our elevation here on the back side of the climb. Steep climb, steep climb, about 0.9 miles, about a mile worth of climbing, and 0.6 on the long ridge. So, gonna be quite a bit of a day. Should be good. I'm looking forward to this long ridge walk here, but this is gonna be super pretty right there. Almost 5.30 in the morning, got plenty of time. And the road out there, I know it looks dark and desolate. The road out there has been pretty busy this morning, so it's gonna be a full crowd going up there. Whew. Wow, switchbacks right out of the gate. That was a lot of fun. Yeah, I saw a log bridge on the map. I didn't know it was an actual log bridge. So if I had to guess that looking the map, I think we've got probably Belford over here. That's probably Missouri in the background. And the trail I think probably goes up here, catches the ridge and goes over. Okay, so I'm at the split. Belford's to the left. It says Elkhead Pass to the right. Doesn't say anything about Missouri though. Of course I'm gonna just scratch MO in there. Let's boogie on that way. That is the coldest water I've ever dipped my hands into in the month of August. Okay, so there is a place to get some water here if you're going up to Missouri Mountain, pretty deep into the hike. We're almost to the end of this, uh, into the gulch. We're almost at the end of the gulch. And I checked the map. At some point up here, uh, Elk Pass is gonna go off to the left and then the trail up to Missouri is gonna go to the right. I don't know exactly where it is, but it's up there somewhere at the very, very end. So let's get on up there. All right, we're at the split. All right, guys, a little bit of an update. The trail goes through that rock field down there, gets to a point, pretty much comes straight up here, and far as I can tell, it's just gonna wrap up there and probably come out in that small, teeny tiny little saddle. And then we'll walk the ridge 0.6 miles over to the summit. All right, guys, we're on the ridge. Decent walking from here. It's not all too bad. Most of the elevation's already been gained, so it's just a nice little half mile walk over to the summit. Very slight gain. I like it. 